Right, welcome back to the channel guys, and today we're going to be talking about manual sacking. There's been the most there has ever been in a season, with 12. We're just going to go over if the managers did or did not deserve it. So without further ado, let's get into it. Connor, you've got a list of seconds, do you want to run us through and we'll yep. discuss if they deserved it or not. So we'll go for the first one, Scott Parker, Bournemouth, Callum, what were we thinking? Did he deserve it or? Well, it, it, in the eyes of everyone, yes. He didn't do well at the start of the season, obviously he had that 9-0, but yeah, yeah. he had his reasons to... Right, the board had his reason, had their reason to sack him, and he had his reason to sack, uh, slag off the board. Yep. He he didn't get enough finan uh, finances available to sign players. Mm -hmm. He didn't get the back end from the board after he just come second. Yep. It is, it, it, last yeah, year. Good point. Good point. But at the end of the day, he's not a good manager. We saw what he's done at, done at Bruges. Yeah. Great job. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I, d I, d I don't know. It, it was. I think he should have stuck with Bournemouth. Maybe, maybe if he kept quiet. He, yeah. He he could but have stayed then, in the job. Would they have been in a bad position compared to where they are now with Gary O'Neill? Because what Gary O'Neill's done is actually nothing really short of general. remarkable. Yeah, with that yeah. squad as well. Yeah. It's a championship and, and, squad. Mm. I mean, with the signs they made in January as well, you can't, mm. you can't notice it. Okay. So we're saying he deserves to be sacked it? for slagging off the board that much. Yeah, okay. uh, I, I could go with that. Yeah, because Gary O'Neill's done well. They've, they've made the right call, I think. Yeah, uh, yeah. yeah. So yeah, right, deserved. Right, next one. Uh, Thomas Tuchel from Chelsea, September the seventh. He was another one that kind of fell out of the bowls, wasn't he? he yeah. Fell out of top bowling, he didn't agree with anything. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. So I think it's another deserved one. Although yeah. it has really hit them in the like a bite, bit them in the foot because they would have been in yeah. a much better situation. With I generally charge. don't think Tuchel deserved to go. No, he didn't. I don't even. He didn't. He didn't. He won them a Champions League with arguably when they shouldn't have won it. Mm. He's, he's, he's won, I think they've exactly won the trophy one. Off the top of my head. Super Cup, I think, as well, after that. Yeah. Um, I don't know if there might be an FA Cup or something in there. I'm not sure. Have been. But again, he's, he's one of the managers who's managed at the top level. He knows, knows what he's about. Yeah, he's managed, he he's he's managed Neymar and, he's, and Bappe, he's managed like, all the big names. It shows with his job now, he's a buyer. Yeah, exactly. He's managed all the big names, and he would be probably the ideal guy in their situation at the moment. But the amount of talent they have in their team. They, able to manage it. they would need someone like Tuchel to lead them out, and not and Graham Potter. They wouldn't have made half of them signings. Mm. Yeah, yeah, he would have made smart charge, he, he, yeah. Made, he, he probably would have gone to the German league and gone, got signed. Yeah, that is probably what. That, he that's, that's, that's the reason why I think he he left rather than he got sacked because he just couldn't stand how incompetent Todd Bowley is. Yeah, he, he, was, he just know. wanted to he just want money where Tuchel wanted to be quite smart with it. Tuchel deserved all undeserved. Undeserved. It was very undeserved. Yeah, so I yeah, yeah, he he all agree with that. Uh, next one is Graham Potter. Now he didn't get Not sacked. Second, yeah, he, he, he left. left. He's yeah. still a manager. The part. Did, so we have to discuss yeah. It. So did Brighton make the right decision, or did Graham Potter make the right decision? We could touch on both. So <laughs> well, Potter made the complete wrong decision. Yeah, yeah. Exactly. <laughs> I mean, yeah but how would you know that at the time? You got a big, oh, yeah, club, you got a big club like Chelsea. You're not going to turn it down. Oh yeah, definitely. You? But you've yeah. got all the money in the world. Mm. But. Brighton have got the better end of the straw. Yeah, getting they are playing. But again, I, great I can play. see Potter doing the same thing that Deserve is doing right now. I can see him yeah. doing that. Yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? I, I, can still see what, him. I wouldn't say as well because I think Deserve is actually a better manager. No, I don't think. He but is, he would have. He would have no. done quite good. But yeah, I don't think Deserve is better. I've, he's seen his record before Brighton. He's getting sacked after six months with Serie A clubs and all that. I don't think he's. As good as manager of Potter is, I don't think. Personally. But he's still doing a he's good. great job. Yeah, 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 he's doing good. <laughs> yeah, yeah, but I don't think he's better than Potter. So, what are we going with Potter then? Should he have gone or should he have stayed? Made yeah. the wrong choice. I Made think he should have gone. I do think, but I don't think he should have gone to Chelsea. I, I, I really thought that at the start of the season, Conte would have gone. So yeah. I reckon he would have done better at the Tottenham job. But that's mm -hmm. just me. Yeah, okay. Next one, uh, Bruno Large from Wolves. Oh, that's a very, sticky one. No, that was very well deserved. They were bottom of the league. No, but yeah. Wolves at that time were just an awful team. At that point in time, I don't think any manager would have they've got, been able they've, to do. They've practically got the same squad now. No, I mean, they've got apart, that, from, no, apart no. from Cunha and stuff like that. They've practically mm. got the same squad. But what? A, I, personally, I think Wolves made the right decision. Lopetegui. Oh, what, massive, a manager. what a signing! Yeah. You can say a signing. What yeah, a, yeah, a, yeah. Like, appointment that yeah. is. Yeah, really. yeah, yeah. yeah. I'd, I rate Lopetegui. I, saw, I said it in the uh, when we graded the transfer window. Yeah. Mm. Uh, I said he's, he's quality and he's, he's still doing really well. To Didn't be he fair. Sevilla manager. Isn't he? Yeah. Um, I think he won the Europa League with Sevilla. Um, but yeah, no. So in Wolves, Wolves sounds like they done really well. Got him out the door when they needed to. October as well. So I got it early doors. It was early doors. Yeah, and they've, they've improved. So mm -hmm. so we're saying deserved. Them. Yeah, Fair deserved. Okay. deserved. I'll go with that. Might Next with one, Stephen Gerrard, Aston Villa. Deserved. Yeah. Oh, he deserved. massively deserved. Look, yeah. at, look at Villa now. Yeah, yeah. Again, he's riding off that Rangers sort of. Oh, you know, he Scottish League, two team league. Do you know I'll what I mean? I'll be honest. He should have stuck 
Rangers. Yeah, just another he two seasons. Another few, another few, yeah. another mm. few seasons with Rangers. Try and go a little streak with them because I mean, no, we, obviously, if you don't want to spot, so you don't know. But yeah. Celtic have win it for years. Yeah, and they're they're like the cycle. Clear now, aren't they? Yeah, so. yeah. I mean, he stopped that ten in a row, didn't he? At, he did. Celtic. He did. But yeah, I just don't think he's. Premier League worthy. I think you've got to do what Lampard did in the Championship with like you with know, Derby. You know what I mean? At least have yeah, something to. Off. Yeah, yeah. Um, but yeah, he's not Prem Prem quality. 100%. So Gerard deserved. Gerard is very much deserved. Hundred uh, percent. Next one, Ralph Hasenhutl, Southampton. Again, deserved. They're bottom. Of, they're near the bottom at the time. Yeah. You, you think of a side that really shouldn't have been where they were at the time yeah. and they still are at the same place I mm, do so. feel a bit sorry for Arsene Hootle though same because um, I believe it's good manager but that Southampton squad is awful I know and and that's down to backing uh, yeah. yeah it's down to backing the manager but if, if you if you sack Hasen who is he, he's Premier League proven like, I think he's been there for, for what, three, three years three years yeah, three he's seasons like serving yeah so he was he was experienced and you're bringing in Nathan Jones from Luton yeah. we'll you know get on I mean? to that oh yeah. boy, boy. Like, that guy is oh, he is word. He's like David Brent of football. That's yeah, what been called best manager in Europe. I, you know, I, I saw him last year, and he's not my. He's, like, he's literally carbon copy. Um. So yeah, hasn't it all deserved or undeserved? Deserved. I'm going undeserved. Yeah, I'm going undeserved. Yeah. 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 I think he should have stayed, especially with the replacement they got him with. Yeah. Uh. Next one, Frank Lampard, Everton. Massively deserved. Deserved. Yeah, hundred percent. Him at Everton. He just again. There's no. He didn't really have an identity. Like, he didn't have really. This is where we play. You know what I mean? There's he, no real. Anything, and the thing is, you, 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 you sold Richarlison and he didn't replace him. Uh, you can't really say he didn't replace him, it's more about the club that they bought in Neil Mope. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? Yeah, they they expect things of bad goals, like, yeah. it's Neil Mope. You know no, what I mean? Unless he's playing against West Ham. That was because yeah. DCL was injured, not a direct replacement for Richarlison. <laughs> so, deserved or undeserved? Yeah, deserved. Very deserved. Deserved, yep. Yeah. Yeah. Cool. Next one, Jesse March, um, Leeds. Deserved. Yeah, yeah, deserved. Deserved, yeah. Um, he wasn't great at Leeds. He, he just about survived last year. Yeah. He showed passion though, but passion don't get you results. But again, it falls down to tactics, I think, with March. Like, he had the passion, but it's just no real. I don't think he had anyone great next way to him of playing. Either. But you can also, yeah. you can, with, all, with all these, you can say, oh, you can blame the manager. Mm-hmm. But if you don't have someone decent next to you as well, it's well, just. Well, like the assistant. That yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah fair enough. Downhill. So, deserved? Yeah. Deserved. Cool. Uh, I'll go deserved as well. Um. Nathan Jones, Southampton. <laughs> Most deserved in the list. Yeah. Do we, need, do we really need to talk about this? No. Nah. I'd love to. Nah. Oh my word. That's a video <laughs> in itself. Absolute car crash. It's a video in itself with Nathan Jones. Yeah. Best XG last year in Luton Town. <laughs> yeah. Got sixth place. Yeah. Which, fair enough, but this, what is he doing honestly, this year? Honestly. Honestly. He had a head loss after three games. Yeah, and then that's a record. He started coming out like it was Jose Mourinho in press conferences and he's like, you're, you're not the special one. He didn't like, even, just like, like, like Grant, if he won the playoffs, fair enough. He didn't win, he <laughs> won <laughs> nothing. Yeah, exactly, yeah. <laughs> he, I, don't, I think he won one game. Yeah, right. Deserved. Deserved, yeah. <laughs> Very. Right. Jesus, he's a, he's a top. Cool, right, next one. Crystal Palace, Patrick Vieira. Again, this... I don't know. I re- do you know what? It was one of them. I know they went on that massive loss streak. They didn't, or not, oh, without a win. Mm. But I thought Vieira done a great job when he was there before that. If you saw the 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 fixtures they had, yeah, from January until yeah, he got sacked, yeah, yeah. he had all of the top six and then two informed teams with Brentford and Brighton, and yeah, he got yeah. sacked because of that. Yeah, it's a bit harsh, but again. This is a results game. If you ain't getting the results, you're gone. Yeah, I but, know, but you can't. You I can't you... go into a game where you've played yeah. all the top six twice. I think it was a little bit harsh, but I can see why, as an owner, they'd get rid of it. Yeah. Them. So, yeah. what are we saying? Deserved? I'm or saying. Undeserved? I'm saying slightly undeserved, just because undeserved. of the pictures. I'm saying, I'm saying it's undeserved. Undeserved. Yeah. I'm, yeah. I'm going undeserved as well. I think he's. Yeah. yeah. I think he would have beat the teams that Raw Hodgson has beat, but not in the style that they have now. I think they would have beat him, but not. It's a new manager bounce. Yeah, exactly. I do yeah, think Vieira right. will be back in the Premier League. Yeah, he, he deserves it. He should it. be. He should be. Yeah. Right, next one. Antonio Conte, Tottenham. I deserve, man. Yeah. It's got well, he, he kind of left, didn't he? I, 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 but he I, still counts the departure. He, he, that Tottenham squad is, is a curse. Because they're, yeah. they're, they're, no, they're, it is. It is you, yeah. you don't have any winners in there. No. Apart from Kane. Is Kane the winner? <laughs> What's he won? You know what I mean. You know what I mean. Kane won. You know what I mean. Kane won. You know what I mean. Like yeah. Kane, Kane's won 
personal trophies. Anyone, got, anyone but Kane. The guy is a walking meme for winning nothing. You've got, the, you've got <laughs> fair enough. The Reese has won a World Cup, but a goalkeeper does not win you a league. Yeah, yeah. A team does. Yeah. They, they just got a. I don't know. It's just in their system. Like it's deep it in is, the roots of Tottenham. As called Spursy for a reason. As, Ke- yeah. as Chiellini was said once, it is the history of the Tottenham. Yeah, yeah. exactly. It, it, yeah, and Conte. You could tell that he's, man did not want to be there. Conte no. slagged off Levy. Conte slagged off the players. Yeah. He slagged off the board. He slagged off everyone. Every press conference, he was basically going into, into saying, everyone. "Give me a sack. Yeah. Just give me a sack yeah. now. I want the yeah. money. Yeah. Just give me a sack." Yeah. 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 Well, I, I think he's deserved. He shouldn't have. He should. No matter any circumstances, he can't be talking shit about his his owners or his players. It's just you can't do that. Deserve. Conte deserve. Yeah. Okay. Undeserved. Okay. Uh, Brendan Rodgers, Leicester. You see, I really like Brendan Rodgers. Yeah, I do as well. I like him, yeah. Yeah, I do. Undeserved, I'm going. Yeah. I, do you know what? I, I, I'm going to say deserved just because of their league position. Yeah, but that's... Just because of how bad they're doing with the squad of players he's got. Yeah. Got, like, this, Tielemans, this, Madison, Vardy. This season... Barnes. This season... And... Uh, this season is deserved, but in general terms, what he's done for Leicester is undeserved. Unreal. He's won the FA Cup, with uh, Yeah, exactly. Uh, Community Shield as well? No. No, just, no, he, no he yeah, FA Cup. Um, but yeah, still, what a, what a manager. Um, he deserves definitely another shot at the Prem. Maybe the Tottenham job, as we were saying. So I'd go, I'd go deserve because of this season, oh, but I mean, in general. I, I, for, this, just, for this season alone. Deserve, yeah. Cause it's, it's really I'll, I'll stick with undeserved because. Yeah. yeah. Okay. And most recent one, Graham Potter Chelsea. Deserved. <sighs> yeah. Deserved. He yeah. deserved, but I think he should have had the whole season. Do you kind of feel sorry for him? Because, yeah, because yeah. in a sense, yeah. yeah. He spent so much money, but I, would, would you say it's him? So, so they've paid... They've 600 million this year. 600 million? Yeah. And they're expecting to get away with financial fair play if they don't get Champions League this year. Yeah. Chelsea sure. are going to collapse in a few they're years. Like, they're 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 the amount what, of sanctions what, what, that, they're going to get. That is... You cannot get away with that. 600 million in one year. Sorry, what? <laughs> 300 million in both transfer windows. Yeah, yeah. so what are we going with that one? Potter. I'm going deserved, 100%. Uh, results wise, deserved, but yeah. in general, undeserved. So I'll go slightly undeserved. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, so that's all them managers. That's all, the, yeah. that's all the managers done. Is there any we've got wrong? Is there any you think should have been sacked, not have been sacked, let us know. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe. We'll see you in the next one.